Assalamualaikum. Welcome to Pharma Inform. Today we will discuss what is the difference between pressure gauge and the compound gauge. Gauges are of great importance in pharmaceutical industries, and you have seen different types of the gauges installed on various machines and equipment. And these gauges may be the pressure gauges and the compound gauges. Many of you are not aware about the difference between the pressure gauge and the compound gauge. Mean. when the pressure gauge is used and what is the purpose of the compound gauge so in this video we will try to remove this confusion and if you have not subscribed my channel first of all press the subscribe button so now let's start our video pressure gauge pressure gauge is used in pharmaceutical industries to display the value of the pressure mean if we only want to display the value of the pressure mean pressure of the water or air pressure we use the pressure gauges the example of pressure gauges is the gauge installed on the system of compressed air mean where we have the compressed air system we have a gauge and this gauge is known as pressure gauge this pressure gauge have simple reading values mean it starts from zero and give the positive values so at the atmospheric pressure value will be zero and when we increase the pressure the needle starts moving towards the higher upper values mean 10 20 100 and this indicate the value of pressure this is the function or purpose of the pressure gauge mean a pressure gauge installed on the compressed air pipe will provide us the value of the pressure so what is the purpose of compound gauge or what is the compound gauge compound gauge basically give us two readings one reading for for the pressure and other reading for the vacuum this gauge is marked with two values one value is in positive digits and other value is in the negative digits compound gauges are installed on those equipments where we need to measure the value of both the pressure and vacuum at the atmospheric pressure the needle will be at zero and when we apply pressure mean when pressure is increased it give us value in the positive digits and move towards the 100 value mean a positive value will give us the reading of the pressure but when we apply the vacuum the needle will move in the opposite direction and give us the reading in the negative value where the compound gauge is used one of the most common example of the installation of compound gauge is the autoclave in autoclave we need the measurement of both the pressure and the vacuum so compound gauge is installed on the autoclave and when we need the value of pressure mean when we apply the pressure it give us the reading of pressure and when we apply the vacuum it give us value of the vacuum so i hope now you are familiar what is the difference between the pressure gauge and vacuum gauge if you like the video share it to others do subscribe my channel visit my website pharmainform.com if you are looking for job visit my website thepharmacistjobs.com and till the next video allah hafiz